So we recently started printing on a selection of fine art uh, digital papers from Canson and from Moab. This paper uh, is the Canson Montval Aquarelle. Wow. And what I've done thick. is taken uh, a digital image and desaturated it. So it took out some of the color and now I'm actually, like this section, I've gone back in with watercolor on the image itself to make the whole thing look more painterly. Right. Yeah, you can really see the lemons kind of popping yep, there. and just built in some of this texture in the stone, a little bit of richness in the color. Um, so it's really quite simple to do um, because the papers have a digital coating on them. They're really quite very absorbent. So you really want yeah, to do something like uh, what we refer to as a wet on wet technique. Um, and just mixing some of my lovely Da Vinci watercolors here. You can use whatever, obviously, whatever colors you want. You could actually go in with fluid acrylics if you wanted to create a different type of feeling. And are the papers already ready for wet on wet? Yeah, because the what's happening is the way that digital papers are produced is they they put um, like a micro coating on the canvas, which allows uh, uh, sorry on the paper which allows the paper to trap the ink in a very specific spot. So when you're putting on watercolor, it's the same type of idea. It's actually trapping uh, the watercolor into the top coating, very similar way that you would do with your normal watercolor paper with its, its type of sizing. So I requested this music just for you guys, so you know, in the background. <laughs> So it's actually the, the possibilities for works on paper, going in with things like pencil crayons or watercolor pencil crayons and actually doing drawing components and then you can use your brush to move some of that around. Really the, the possibilities of, of what you can do are, are totally endless. You could use like acrylics on papers too, yeah. right? You, you can use acrylics, you can use heavy bodied acrylics, you can use fluid acrylics. Wow, the possibilities are endless. The possibilities are endless. Well, Suzanne, that was great. Thank you for the demonstrations, and we hope you enjoyed those.